So, without further ado, let's get on with what this show's all about. Giving pieces of metal to pop stars. It's the one I know we've all been waiting for, the award for MasterCard British Album. Joining us tonight to announce the winner is one of British music's all-time greats, Sir Tom Jones! Whoa! Sorry I was a bit late coming out because I was uh, talking to girls aloud back there. I was kissing them and congratulating them. So anyway, so here I am. So hello everybody, and what a great night it's been, yes? Everybody having a good time, I hope. Okay, so now we come to the big award of the night. The MasterCard British Album of the Year. Now, obviously, I've got my own favorite candidate for this one, but in the interest of fair play, let's see the whole, no, sorry, let's see who is nominated. Who's hit the jackpot on one British album of the year? Hopefully, Viva La Vida or Death and All His Friends. And I ain't faking this, I ain't faking it. Ting -ting. We started nothing. A seldom seen kid. Nerd your head in rainbows. Nothing. Rock Ferry. I'm standing over right on my own. And the winner is. Duffy, Rock Ferry. Three guns in a single night puts Duffy up there with the Robbie Williams, the Scissor Sisters, Kaiser Chiefs, and, uh, and the Darkness as triple whammy winners. Rock Ferry's producer, Bernard Butler, won the Brit Award for Producer of the Year. And now it's a clean sweep of the board at tonight's Brit Awards for Duffy. She'll be out painting the town red tonight, I'll bet. From one, from one Welsh person to another. Thank you very much. There's your reward. God bless you. Well, I'm going to keep it together for this one, but um, thank you so much. I just want you to know that for the record, I travelled this whole country from Wales to London and back again a thousand times playing my songs to old ladies who are probably watching the TV tonight saying that they heard some of my songs. So thank you to the British public. I can't tell you what this means after five years. Thank you so much. <laughs> 